Needless to say, bourbon is big business in Kentucky, accounting for more than 20,000 jobs and growing with an annual payroll of $1 billion. Spirit consumption rolls $235 million into the state's coffers annually. The University of Kentucky and Beam Suntory want to address the needs of the future and where the distilling workforce will come from. I think this partnership with the University of Kentucky can bring all the distillers together. We are a unique industry. We do get along. I mean, very few do you see peers who compete on a shelf get together and enjoy each other's company. But I can see us all working together as a group to help this industry be the number one whiskey in the world. Influence your oxidation rate. UK has been offering a certificate in distilling wine and brewing since 2014 and just last year formed the James B. Beam Institute for Kentucky Spirits. The institute builds on the certificate program as well as research and outreach. Seth DeBolt. The conference addressed key topics those in the industry deal time, with on a regular basis. The industry is growing so fast we can't find the talent fast enough. And the perfect place is the University of Kentucky as far as I'm concerned. So uh, we're, we're devoted to you know, looking for talent here. Our future is, future is with the youth and trying to educate them. And what we've learned, trying not to pass on our bad habits, but try to, to hone some good habits to, to learn uh, so much more, but also to build a, a great passion for the industry. The historic Cooper House here on the UK Ag Campus will soon be renovated, and behind it will be a new building that will house the James B. Beam Institute for Kentucky Spirits. And also on this site, thanks to a $1 million gift from Independent Stave Company, will be the Boswell Family Barrel House which will allow the Beam Institute to experiment with barrel aging spirits. Yeah, it's going to um, be about 600 barrel house for experimentation. It'll also be for training young distillers of the future and distillery workers of the future. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.